Hi everybody, it's Janet Michelle at You Caught Me Crafting. I am so, so excited to show you guys this sneak peek for the Game of Thrones Iron Anniversary, which is their 10th anniversary. And I just looked around their HBO website and apparently all of Game of Thrones is streaming on there, which I think it always has been, but now they're going to be putting up extra interviews with actors and writers, producers. I have no idea who could be on there, but it sounds exciting and extra behind the scenes, things like that. So definitely something I think you should check out. I know I will be. Let's get started. Just in case you were wondering, this is a Diamond Art Club Me Time Candle and they do smell great. And this, you know my little clips I use, I got another one. I will link it below, my affiliate links to all my little items that I just use on diamond paintings. Literally, I use these on every diamond painting. And this one's just very cute and it has like 200 in it or something ridiculous. <laughs> and it says happy day. So just in case you're wondering what's off to the left during this. I put this picture because Min Yoongi or Suga plays a king in this music video. And it's only befitting for a king to be on an iron throne. Look how cool this packaging is. It is a square right here. Let me clear that up. Five colors including 1AB. Total diamonds 94,457. So if you love multi-placing squares, this is for you. I also think this picture is gorgeous and it looks just like a poster and this is cool because if you're a big fan of the show and you have merch and things all around your room it's kind of like not just going out and buying a poster but making a poster of your own and you can add things subtract do whatever you want i just wanted to say i'm so excited i hope you guys are too i don't think i've ever seen a diamond painting from diamond art club with five colors and one eb but we're about to see what that looks like it is a 70 by 86. Here's our little red and beige sticker. It says, by Game of Thrones and all related characters and elements. Wow. I'm so excited to see this. Let me get this kit out. Let's quickly go through this toolkit. It's a square. If you get a round painting, the only difference is it won't have tweezers. And just to let you know, if you are a first time buyer from Diamond Art Club, welcome to the club. It's amazing. And you can get $10, not just 10%, but $10 off of your first purchase using my code. It's right here. You caught me crafting. And no pressure. I just wanted to give that to you because I'm a single mom, so I understand coupons are great. And sometimes $10 is more than 10% or 15% of a purchase. So use it, don't use it, do whatever you would like. And let's go through this toolkit really quickly. We have our tweezers, very sharp. We have our bag of baggies, an orange squeegee, so I think an orange pen, don't you think? We have this pretty flower washi tape and another beautiful rose. I have a whole garden now. I'm loving these. We have the two dark pink hearts of wax in this cute container. We have our gold sparkly boat with, with the plug, our orange pen, and a four and a seven multi-placer, which for this one, I think you're gonna need to go even bigger, or you can single place this whole thing if you'd like to. I know that some people prefer that. Remember, this is your craft, your poster, your painting. Do whatever you want to. I will put this stuff away, take this plastic off, and be right back. I'm so excited. This all comes in the middle of this, so I just shook it out and you can see <laughs> here are five total colors. Wow. Five total. I will show you the artwork. So here is the artwork up close. The Iron Throne, red and beige. 
and I love, love, love what they did with so little colors. You can see we have this background color, but then we have Game of Thrones in that same color. We have, I think these are all the houses, right? We have, let's see if I can get this right. We have the Dire Wolf, so that's the Starks. The Stags are the Baratheons. The Lannister Lions. The Flayed Men. The... The... What's his name? Ramsey Snow, Ramsey Bolton. Ramsey Bolton, this looks like a dragon. So maybe the Targaryens. I can't see anything closer, but. So we have all the houses and then this. Hmm. Could be. Aren't the roses the Tyrells? I'm not sure, but there's one up here. Which house is this, guys? And then there is your throne. So it really is like making your own poster. And here is a bird, and here is a circle. I know one is like House of Aaron, one of the circles or something, but let's go ahead and get to the canvas. I'm sure you guys already know this, but I'll go through this very quickly. It's a thank you packet with instructions, tips and tricks. There is, you know, a little place to go to the VIP Facebook group, a thank you coupon code. And then on the back it says when you download the app, you can get 20% off if you use the QR code or they will give you a code when you download that app. And I love the app. I use it so, so much. So that's what's in this packet. And you'll get it every time you make a purchase. This is so large. So definitely like a big movie poster, you know, that you would put on your walls. I know I've put so many band movie posters, vinyls, things like that up on my walls. Let's unroll this. I'm going to part of my reach. Move this candle. Let me start this. And we're slowly getting to our beautiful throne. Have you ever seen? Sorry. Look at the schematic. It's so adorable. I never thought I'd call a schematic with the symbols and the DMC colors adorable. Game of Thrones so clearly. Here's our dire wolf. These are the different sigils. Ugh. A flayed man. To me that always seemed the worst way to go in Game of Thrones. <laughs> but amazing. So 70 by 86. Let's measure that really quickly. Look how beautiful the red and the black is on the throne. Gorgeous. 70 by 86. Oh, this is 69. So if it's one centimeter smaller than if it's 70 by 86, then it should be 69 by 85, which doesn't bug me at all. I like as long as they still match. You know, if it's a one centimeter short, I want it to be one centimeter short on both sides so that I know the proportions are still correct. So yes, you can't see, but sorry, one centimeter short on both sides, which doesn't bug me at all, especially when you consider the sides. That just means one less centimeter of these square, big multi-glacing areas. I'm just gonna flatten this out very quickly and then I will show you the diamonds. Our five colors. So, here is our very full bag of diamonds. Five colors, but let's go ahead and just go through them very quickly and count how many bags we have of each. And then I'll show you where that one AB is going to go. Let's go ahead and count how many bags we have and go through these colors. Let me just take them out and get them ready. Here are our colors, and we have 945, 939, 666. Our AB is 107, and we have one little bag of 823. So, 
I cut these into rows of 10, so we have 26 bags of 945, which is of course going to be the main multi-placing color. We have 939, which has, it's gonna go all over the throne, 666, and that is the dash, so that will go on the throne. So these two colors are the throne, this bag of 823, those are gonna be these little dark dots down here. And then I'm gonna move these. You've seen the color palette, you get it. It is called the Iron Throne Red and Beige. So it is kind of like making a poster for yourself, you know? I know some people have said on places where there are large multi-placing, they sometimes will cut the edges off if it's too much or do anything like that. And I know some people would think that's awful, but if you do love this image, but you just might want to take off the parts where it's just multi-placing and there's no, there aren't sigils or anything like that, or if you just want the throne, which, you know, I would keep the sigils, but it's your art, of course. You know, then you can always do that to make the multi-placing seem, you know, less intense. <laughs> I'm going to move these and let's see where these ABs go and I'm pretty sure they're going to be the sigils so we'll just look at those really quickly. That'll be so much fun. I love this one. I love minimalistic posters for movies, bands, soundtracks, you know, I love minimalistic vinyls and things like that so this kind of poster is totally my style and I'm wondering is it yours do you like posters with a lot of stuff on them or something like this where you know it just has an object you know like a Lord of the Rings poster if it just had like the one ring or you know just something symbolic of Lord of the Rings something like that you know like Harry Potter the Deathly Hallow sign you know, just a big one, or would you like the Harry Potter with all of the characters and everything like that? What do you prefer? I'd like to know. Let me take these off, show you where the ABs go. I really am interested though, please tell me in the comments. I love, love, love talking with you guys. Just one second. The symbol for the AB is the triangle going like this. So, <laughs> you can see there are only five. This would be a very easy one to not have to kit up at all, which would make it extra easy for you. And to go by color, you could just get, you know, the beige done first, and then thrown, and then save these ABs for last because I love the placement. And the ABs are going to go right here, here, here. They are the sigils, so they do go down here into the throne a little bit. Right here, the Targaryen symbol, sigil, I'm sorry, sigil. These are all ladies. Same with the lion, House Lannister. Let me go down, we see Game of Thrones. There we go, there's the stag for House Baratheon. Then we keep going, and here is the flayed man. I think the most terrifying sigil to see. And then down here, we have the dire wolf, the Starks. Then we have this one. I think it's a rose. I think this is the Tyrells, right? I could be wrong. Let me know and I'll do it. oh my goodness, I just spilled my new little cute box of clips I was showing you, but I think it stayed close. I think that one up there it looks like a dove or a bird. I know Tully is fish. If you're not a Game of Thrones fan, you're like, who are you talking about? But that looks like a bird, maybe it's a fish, but if you guys could tell me who these are, maybe I'm just blanking and they're very big houses, but Targaryen, Starks, Lannisters, Baratheons, 
Tyrell the Rose. I'd be interested in this and these two at the top. We will see if you guys will let me know. And also who your favorite characters. Uh, I was going to say no spoilers, but if you've clicked on this and you're interested in buying this, I figure you've seen it. It is the Iron Anniversary 10 years, so, you know, who's your favorite house, favorite character, least favorite character, but best actor, I mean, like Joffrey was so hated that poor, poor, poor young boy had to quit acting, but I heard he started acting in theater because he was so good that he couldn't get roles because <laughs> everyone was like, Joffrey! <laughs> That's where these ABs go, and I'm pretty sure this is Tyrell, because that does look like a rose to me, like the sigil. So, if you'll just let me know what the two at the top are, that'd be great. And down here, you can see the measurements, but remember, it's one centimeter short on both sides, so it's still perfectly measured. And then it has a lifetime warranty right here. And you have free missing diamond protection, so if you lose some or say it comes without enough, you know, it seems like you won't have a problem. I don't think you will, but Diamond Art Club, their customer service is amazing. So I have loved, loved, loved showing you guys this Game of Thrones painting. I'm so excited. I would love... And I'm excited to kind of see Diamond Art Club not only stick to beautiful landscapes in our dark paintings, but beautiful light paintings and florals and just everything we love, but also even more branching out into comics and TV shows and movies and things like that. I just love it because you never know what's going to happen next week. And apparently this week we are starting off with Game of Thrones from me. And who knows from the other sneak peekers and I can't wait to watch their videos. So thank you so, so much for watching my video. Please subscribe, turn on the notifications. I do not have a set schedule, but I plan to post about two to three videos a week. Turn on notifications, please like, comment. I love talking to you guys and it really does help me out. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you have any questions for Within Chats, post them below. Follow me on Instagram, my posts there, and you can just message me anytime. I'm thinking of other things. I'm going to announce a new giveaway very soon. So any of my videos could have little clues in them, which is a lot of fun. <laughs> Subscribe, like, ring the bell, things that we all, you know, always have to say, but I really do just like commenting the most because I love to talk with you guys and get to know you and I just cannot wait to have so many videos coming out for you guys. There are so many great plans in place. If you want to get this amazing painting, maybe for yourself or a friend, I mean it's definitely a painting that could be done by a large group of people while watching the Iron Anniversary specials, all those interviews and all of the behind the scenes stuff. I'm not sure exactly what they have, but I know it's a ton and it looks like so much fun. If you like this kit, it's coming out on June 8th. Tomorrow, if you're watching it on June 7th, I'm not sure when you're watching this, but it's on a Wednesday tomorrow, June 8th. And those kits, these special kits usually come out at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time for everybody. I'm going to go ahead and see that's when it comes out and hopefully there will be other fun designs and I can't wait to see them. So again, I hope that you enjoyed this sneak peek. Again, I'd like you to know what character or show or movie you'd like to see a diamond painting be made into. That's just so interesting to me, getting to know you guys, getting to know your personalities and what you like, what you love. and. I will see you guys so soon. As I always say, be kind to yourself, be kind to others. They don't know what you're going through and you don't know what they're going through, but the most important thing is to just 
be kind to yourself. We all have hard days. And if you're having a hard one right now, I'm so sorry. Day or night. <laughs> I'm not sure when you're watching this, but as we all know, it'll pass. It might not feel like it at the moment, but you know, just know someone's thinking of you. Someone's been there. Someone's felt how you feel. And you know, just be kind to yourself. The world can be a hard place, so the last thing you need is to be hard on yourself. I just care about you guys a lot, and I thank you so much. You mean so much to me. Thank you for all that you do. I can't wait to be able to just keep giving more and more and more to you guys. More giveaways, videos, hopefully doing live streams, all this sort of stuff. I'll have videos explaining it, but this... It's just about this beautiful, well not just, but I just made those couple of announcements, but like I wanted you to be able to look at this. It's just so, so pretty and I think the AB placement will be beautiful. I honestly think it will look like a gorgeous poster in anyone's room. And as I said, I love minimalistic posters, so this is right up my alley. Thank you guys for watching this sneak peek. I hope that you enjoy the Iron Anniversary on HBO Max, the interviews and all of that. I wonder what you guys, if you're gonna watch it, let me know. Let me know how it is. And I will see you guys very, very soon. So take care of yourselves. We'll see you so, so soon. Game of the Thrones. I will have, oh, by the way, I will have everything linked below. Game of Thrones, duh. I was gonna sing the theme song, but decided better. Bye.